Hi guys, welcome back to the channel. If you want a licensed professional to review each and every aspect of your study permit statement of purpose, help you write the SOP during a video consultation by letting you know what is to be included, what is not to be included, how to form an appropriate SOP, what are the relevant section of the law that you might want to address, which are the aspects that you might have highlighted in that SOP that should not have been highlighted? How to form that SOP in a constructive manner to convince an immigration officer citing relevant section of the law, relevant section of the regulations, immigration regulations, you are probably at the right place because I am planning to introduce a service by which I am going to take a call with you and it is going to be a 90 minutes video consultation. After you book the session online through the website novonation.ca, you are expected to forward your study permit SOP statement or purpose, which you have written by yourself or maybe by somebody else as per your preference. You are also expected to forward me the relevant documents that I'm going to ask for it after you have booked the session. And then what I'm going to do is that I'm going to take a day to prepare myself to go over your case. And then when we speak, it is going to be a 90 minutes video call. I'm going to tell you step by step what to be included, what not to be included, each and everything, sentence by sentence, paragraph by paragraph. And in the end, you can take down the notes. You can just, you know, write it. SOP and which would definitely enhance the chances of your success after analyzing a lot of GCMS notes, a lot of it, it is quite clear that a majority of the reasons you know a, a, you know a chunk of those applications chunk of those study permit applications that get refused sop is one of the primary reasons because sometimes i see that applicants have the right candidature application and applicants have the right profile but they are not able to convince to an immigration you know, officer with their right intention as to why they are planning to come to canada what kind of home ties do they have who can sponsor their studies who cannot sponsor their studies what kind of funds to be shown? And if you have shown X, X, Y, Z amount of fund, what are the sources of your funds? Why have you chosen this course? Why not this particular course? What is your plan to do after you complete your you know, course in Canada? And that is not going to be a stereotypical reason that, well, I plan to go back to uh, my home country because of my elderly parents, these and that. It has to be solidly justifiable, constructive reason. So in that 90-minute session, you will have a constructive idea, clear idea what to do, what not to do. And probably the chances of your success increases a lot. So if you need my assistance to do that, all you have to do is to hop into the website, novonation.ca, book a relevant consultation. It's called Study Permit SOP Review Consultation. After you book the consultation, one of my team members is going to reach out to you, will ask for your SOP along with a couple of supporting documents. We'll take a day's time to prepare for it and we have a session it is going to be a video call session over uh, you know google meet i'm going to tell you what to do all the points that we have just discussed in the call to enhance the chances of your success i hope this helps and this is for those that are preferably working on your own or if you are working with an agent the person may not be licensed or if you think that are just a uh, you know second look on that application will be helpful because as a part of my practice i do work with a lot of study permit complicated study permit applications majority of which are uh, from the mature students those who are in their late 30s early 40s and even sometimes late 40s yet want to pursue their studies in canada so this is probably an opportunity that will be helpful to a lot of you and if it does Make sure to book the session um, directly through the website, novonation.ca, and I'll be more than happy to have a one-on-one -on -one discussion with you to be able to guide you in the right direction. Hope this helps. See you guys in the next one. Bye now. Cheers.